The Tupolev TB3, known in design records as Ant-6, was the first mass-produced four-engine heavy bomber built entirely of metal in the Soviet Union. Its development began in 1925 when the Soviet Air Force issued a requirement for a new bomber with 2,000 horsepower total output. Design work at the Tupolev Bureau started in 1926 using the earlier twin-engine TB-1 as a base. The prototype flew in December 1930, piloted by Mikhail Gromov, and entered serial production in 1932 at plant number 22 near Moscow. The TB-3 featured corrugated duralumin skin, a cantilever wing spanning more than 40 meters, and a crew of 8 to 12. Its fixed landing gear carried tandem bogey wheels. Armament consisted of multiple 7.62 mm machine guns placed in turrets on the nose, fuselage, and under the wings. The aircraft could carry over two tons of bombs, internally and externally, and was capable of transporting paratroopers or even light tanks. Early versions used M17 engines, later replaced by more powerful Mechelen M34 and M34R models. Production faced many challenges. Aircraft often weighed more than prototypes due to poor industrial tolerances and shortages of radios, bomb sites, and defensive armament were common. Crews sometimes received incomplete aircraft under factory guarantees. Despite these flaws, by 1933 the Soviet Air Force had over 300 TB-3s, and by the mid-1930s production exceeded 800 units. The bomber was central to the creation of Soviet heavy bomber brigades, some of the first large strategic formations in the world. TB-3s flew in parades, demonstrations, and international missions to Warsaw, Rome, and Paris, where they impressed foreign observers. In combat, the aircraft served in the Battle of Kalkan Gol against Japan, the Winter War with Finland, and extensively in the Great Patriotic War. At the outbreak of the German invasion in 1941, more than 500 TB-3s were operational. They performed night bombing, transport of cargo and troops, and special missions such as the Zveno Project, in which TB-3s launched I-16 fighters carrying bombs. Today, the TB-3 is remembered as a pioneer of heavy bombing, a testament to Soviet engineering and a key player in the early years of World War II. Its story reflects both the ambition and challenges of early military aviation.